Taking down brick and concrete buildings is one thing. But getting steel structures like this water tower to fall exactly the way you want it to requires a little more precision. These are linear shape charges and, and basically they're copper line charges. You can see if you look on this end, you get this right there, you can see the explosives. What happens is when that detonates, it forces this V of copper to form a blade and it cuts right through that steel. Focusing the energy of the explosion in one direction and what's left is a clean cut right through the metal. If you use regular explosives, what you would have is uh, this stuff breaking apart, throwing pieces yeah. of metal everywhere. This just cuts clean. The water tower is part of an old coal plant that the detonator's crew is blasting. The once bustling mill now sits abandoned on Browns Island in West Virginia, smack in the middle of the Ohio River. One of the tower's legs has already been cut and removed, getting the decaying structure ready for demolition. Is there any reason why it's at an angle rather than straight across? Absolutely. Now what happens is this piece has to come out. There's not going to be anybody here to pull it out. So what you have is this is on an angle, and you notice the top side's at a different angle. Yep. It makes a wedge, so when gravity pushes down, it actually helps slide this out. But they don't just rely on gravity. A little dynamite never hurt, too. In this case, they wired some dynamite kickers inside the metal legs to make sure they eject outwards during the blast. Anytime you put uh, metal up against explosives or anything up against explosives, when you detonate it, it's going to go exactly in the opposite direction. Lusk and Jim Redike, president of Dicon Explosives, finish wiring up the two legs they plan to take out. Then it's time to blast. the tower and it just fell so let's go see what it looks like and it looks like a hunk of rusted twisted metal but the legs are perfectly cut just as they wanted for discovery channel i'm jorge ribas